Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be downloading a lot of free games for your PlayStation. So let's just go right into your store. And you don't need to be a PS Plus member in order to download these games that I'm going to show you today. I have another video where it shows you free games with PS Plus membership, but that's different because you are paying for that PS Plus membership. And these games that I'm going to show you today, they do not require any membership. So right now we have this. So just go into free. And before we go into free, just go to the right. And then you're going to see this explore free to play and free to watch. What we want to do is free to play. Just click right there. And then we're going to see all these games. So I already made a video about these two. So we're going to start off with our third game right here. So this is the full game and it's free. So let's just click on it from here. We should see this screen and then we should see download. Just press X right there and it's going to start downloading. Now, a lot of these games are pretty big. This one's 5.96 gigs. So it will take some a while for it to download. However, we can go ahead and keep downloading other ones. So we do have this other game right here. We can go to it once again. And this one's only 682 megabytes, which is around half a gig, just a little bit more. Just click on download. It's supposed to download right away. Again, these are free. So you're not supposed to pay for it for anything. It's not supposed to say a price on it and it's supposed to download right away. Versus when you purchase a game, there is a price on it and it does let you confirm. Right now, this one is also for free. So we're going to go ahead and download Darwin project. Now this is only 3.32 gigs. Let's just download it again. It does depend on your internet speed, how long each one of these games will take to download. So for some of you, this could be really fast. Others, this could be really slow. So right now we have this VR game. We're going to go ahead and download it. This one's also three gigs. Press download. And there we go. It started. Obviously, since I'm downloading a lot of games, it's going to take a little bit longer. But as you guys can see, there's a few VR games which are right in here. So it's great. Because a lot of people were asking me about VR games and there aren't that many. So this one's 1 1.79 gigs. Perfect. Let's just download it. Once the download begins, we can always go back. We can keep playing other games if you guys like. You don't have to stay here. You don't have to download all these games that I'm doing right now. But we're going to go into the next one. Now this one's a PSN game. All right. So let's just click free. Then again, we're just going to download it. And there we go. The download has begun. We can always go back. We have another game right here. This one's only 4.44 gigs. So now that big again, we can begin the download just press back go down we have this other game right here same deal this one's 12 gigs so this one's bigger than the other ones that we had downloaded previously so this one will take a little bit longer to download but there we go it's right there perfect now some of these games do contain in-app purchases those are just optional purchases you do not need to purchase anything in order to play the games so this one is also 8.68 gigs, which is quite big. Let's just download it. There we go. Let me just go back. I'm gonna go down to Genesis full game. Press and download once this pops up. And there we go. So again, you may see those messages where it says game may have in-app purchases. Those are optional this one's only 5.65 gigs again pretty small let's just go down we have this guy right here let's just download him once we see download we can go ahead and press download there we go and this one's only 248.32 megabytes so it's the smallest one that we are gonna download today maybe there might be a smaller one later on so don't ever think, there we go, let's just download this game as well. Now this one isn't too huge, this one's only 5.53 gigs, download it. And like I mentioned, as long as we don't see a price on it, it's not verifying our payment information or anything like that, you should be fine. And Spider-Man, here we go, so let's just press download. This one's 2 gigs, so it's pretty small to be a Spider-Man game and especially VR. VR is usually a little better, but then again, this game isn't as complex as others. 
Now let's just go God of War. Okay, this one's two gigs. Sounds good. Let's just download it. And let's just go back. Now Dauntless already made a video about that. So I'm going to leave that alone. And then we have World Go Worships. This one's 14 gigs. So this one has been the biggest game so far that we have been downloading. So this one's gonna take the longest in order to download. However, once they're downloaded, we will play them all. Now let's go into Path of Exile. This one shouldn't be too huge, 9.27 gigs. It's around there, it's one of the big ones. Not as big as the one before, which was 14 gigs, but still big. Now let's just go back. And we have Dragon Ball, which I already made a video about this actually. So that's why I just press download. But I already did a video on this. So I'm sure that I already downloaded this once before. Now let's go into Dead or Alive and press download. As long as this is working just as you guys see, you're gonna be fine. So this one is the biggest one so far. It's 30.13 gigs. So this one will take quite a bit in order to download. Then we have Final Fantasy. Now this is the free edition. We're just gonna download it. 17 gigs. So it's up there, it's up there. It's not as big as 30 gigs, the one before, but it's still pretty big at 17.41 gigs. Let's just go back and keep downloading. So we have uh, ESO Island. And here we got 349 megabytes. So this is quite small. This is not even half a gig, guys. So for most of you, this will be quite fast in order to download. Now let's just go back. We have Kingdom. Let's just go right there. VR game. 3.25 gigs, so this one should be okay. Just download it. So again, there usually tends not to be as many VR games, but as you guys could see so far, there's quite a few. Now, Hitman, we already purchased this from before, so I already made a video about that. So we're just gonna go into Fishing Planet Starter Bundle. Well, this is a bundle, not the game itself, but let's just download it. Why not? So this is a start bundle once again. We're just gonna download it. And there we go. Then we have Apex Legends full game. Once this loads up, we should see the download and it's 23.1 gigs. So let's just press on download. And the download will begin right away. Again, downloading time for me will take quite a bit because I'm downloading all these guys, all these games for you guys to see. Now we have this right here, which we are gonna download as well. So this is 4.49 gigs. Let's just press download. Let's wait for it, and there we go. So it's being added to our downloads. We do have Switchblade as well. Let's just go right down to Switchblade. This one's 2.5 gigs. Let's download. Perfect. Let's just go into our next game, which is PlayStation VR Demo Disc 3. Well, this one's a little bit different than your normal games. We're just gonna download it right away. There we go. This one's 13 gigs. Pretty big, pretty big. Let's just go back. So far, the biggest game that we've downloaded has been 30 gigs. Just keep that in mind. Right now, we have this game right here. And we got this one is just over half a gig with 587 megabytes. So again, once it begins download, we're just going to go back. Our next game right here, unavailable. That's okay if it says that. We can actually still download it. And then if not, just go back to it and then download it later on. So in this case, yes, it's telling me it's not available for purchase. That's okay, we'll go back to it later on and download it. Sometimes they just need to refresh. Next up, 
we have this one right here legend perfect this one's 3.7 gigs again VR which is great say hey, VR is pretty expensive so you know, to get a lot of free games it's a good thing then let's go right here another VR now this one's only 3.84 gigs which uh, should download quite fast so there we go we just added this let's just go back let's go into our next one now this game is quite big at 21.95 megabytes <laughs> so this is gonna be really fast guys you don't need to worry about this one that's just megabytes it's not gigs it's gonna download really really fast let's just go back now Warface, I'm pretty sure I made a video about this guy before, but if it gives us the option to download it right now, we are gonna do that. Okay, let's just download it. Again, I'm pretty sure I made a video about this from before, but just to add it to our library, I'm just gonna download that one as well. Then we have this one, it's another VR. And we're gonna press download. And here we go, this one's 5.1 gigs. Then we got 2050, which is also free. And we're gonna press download. This game isn't too huge, but not too small. It's 17.36 gigs. So get ready to wait for that one to download. Then we have Fall Down Shelter. Again, this is pretty small. It's not even half a gig. We're just looking at 393 megabytes. We're just gonna go back. Make sure if you guys don't find any of these games right here, you guys can always search, search it up. So on the top, you will see search and just look for the game in particular. So right now we're looking at 9.37 gigs. We're gonna press download as well. And like I mentioned before, I'm just gonna go back again. Up there, you will see the second option say search. So if you don't find the particular game that you want, just go into search and download it from there. Um, the reason why it took you this way is just to show you all the games that are available right now. So this is uh, 2.03 gigs, we're gonna download it. Let's just go back. We have adventures right here. We're also gonna download this. But this one, again, it's just about half a gig. We're looking at 487 megabytes. Let's just go back. And then we have Terra, which I already made a video about that bundle, so it's okay. We have Minefield. And we're looking at 1.12 gigs required. Pretty small. Pretty fast upgrade. Well, download, I mean. Let's just go back. Don't bite me, bro. Pretty fun name. Let's just download this one as well. And we're looking at something really, really small. At only 150 megabytes. I think it's the smallest one that we have downloaded during this whole video. Let's just go to the next one. This one should say free as well. Yep. And we can go ahead and download it. Like I mentioned from before, as long as you guys don't see a price on it, it's not verifying your payment information. It's not giving you anything fishy like that. It should be free. So you should be okay. So this one's Terra again. That's a purchase. So that means I already made a video about it. I'm not gonna download that one. We're gonna go move over to Armored Warfare. So let's just download it. This one's 21 gigs, so another one that's gonna take quite a while in order to download, but definitely worth it. Once the download starts, let's just go back. Again, you don't need to wait for the game to actually download the whole way. Let's can go ahead and play other games or keep downloading more and more games. So the last Guardian, our demo. This is a demo, so that's different. Just a little bit different than a regular full game. See, it's only gonna give you a part of the game in order to download. Let's just go back. 
next game up this guy and we're looking at 7.84 gigs let's just download it there we go it's being added let's just go all the way back and we have the illusionist once again we're gonna download this and we're looking at 593 megabytes just press download now let's just go back and we have a bunch of other games in order to download but you guys get the picture of how you're supposed to download all these games so keep downloading all the ones you guys like if you're having any problems if you guys have any questions comments you guys can write down here in comments area and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you